Super Tato, books are rubbish. <laughs> it was night time in the supermarket and the veggies had been happily reading for hours. <laughs> then crash bang, in stomped the evil pea. Why are you all so quiet? What are you up to? We're reading, said the veggies. My book is called Exciting Electronics. It shows you how things work, said Carrot. Mine is a story about a unicorn, said Cucumber. My book, said Tomato, is called Knitting for Beginners. Knitting for nitwits, more like, <laughs> snorted the pea. What a waste of time! Books are rubbish! Everyone knows that! There's only one thing books are good for! And with that, he started to pile them up higher and higher. All the way to the ceiling. Let's see them try and read. In the dark! <laughs> Luckily, Aubergine found a torch, but when she shone it upwards, everyone gasped. <gasps> so, you like to get lost in a good book, do you veggies? Well, get lost in these! <laughs> oh no! Panicked the pineapples. <laughs> Cried the veggies bumping into each other in the dark. Ouch! Ouch! Aubergine shone her torch. Tomato, how can you get at a time like this? <laughs> it was chaos, and Super Tato was nowhere to be seen. Oh no! What would save them this time? Books, that's what! Resourceful readers to the rescue! Carrot used her electronic super skills to fix the light. Tomato used his knitting know-how to knit a net. And Cucumber used magical, mystical, rainbow, twinkle-tastic sparkles to make the world a better place. With danger averted and the lights back on, the veggies decided it was time to deal with the pea. You've gone a step too far this time, said the veggies. There's no such thing as a step too far, shouted the pea. But as it turned out, the pea was wrong. <laughs> <gasps> Sorry to hear you've hurt yourself, pea, said Super Tato. But don't you worry, we know just what you're going to need. While you're getting better, some good books to read. <laughs> the end. Hi, kids. Did you have fun watching this video? Then like and subscribe for more. <laughs> <laughs>